I'll come back, people, to Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker <clears throat> Recollection, <clears throat> Episode 11. This is uh, Episode 11. Uh, we had the most unprofessional, like, I can't figure out where to end this to last episode ever. <laughs> Whoops. Fuck it. Peace Walker is in a hangar at the very bottom of the mine. So this is where you start getting into even more super villainy, non-Cold War shit. Because the last game was all like fun Cold War base shit. This is like, this is James Bond bullshit. Evil underground base. Uh, let's see, we're going to be in close, so I'm going to bring the silenced... What, what, what? What was what? that? What was that? It's my little thing. What? Ew! Stop rubbing <laughs> your little thing on your microphone. No, it's a ratcheting device. Gay. Gay. Ha! Gay. Stop ratcheting on camera. You can't tell me what to do. You know my father. Strange loves pretty ratchet. How do you know? Because you're white. Okay, so you come down here. So are you. You come down here, and there's all these fucking. <laughs> there's all these chrysalises. You see that shit? Oh my gosh. Shit's crazy in the Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> They know you're there. They kind of know like, I'm there. He's bitch, he's over there. Actually, I think they're doing some kind of training exercise, but the good news is Shit, fuck, piss. Fuck. Ass. Piss a man. Piss on my ass. No. <laughs> uh, there's a bunch of secrets in here if I remember correctly. Okay, I think that's all the men. So let's drop down here and grab those men. Hey, hey, suspend your disbelief. <laughs> yeah. Wee. Yeah, that's that's probably fine. They're probably okay. If I remember correctly, there is a bunch of shit in this area now. Cuz now we're now we're like in the base, so you get all the base tech. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. Uh, but there is a like lot of infiltration coming up here, so I'm not gonna try and Fulton everybody. Ah, fuck it, I'm Fultoning everybody. So, like, stuff for, like, Mother Base and stuff? Yeah, 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 like, items you can develop. Weapons and... Pictures of your father. I haven't seen him in years! Years. Uh, let's see. There's stuff over here. No, I can't open the door with the security level so high. What, because I'm in caution? But caution? the game started in caution. Oh, look, there's an orange man. Yeesh. Sending that orange man into the sky. And that wasn't a euphemism for murder. <laughs> Although it very easily could have been. Easily. What are you doing, bro? Stop moving so much, you son of a bitch. Ass. Ass. And titties. Ass. And titties. Shut up. What? Uh, that's not where I want to go. How the fuck do I get over there? I know there's the ladder down there, but is that the only way? I guess so. Suck it. All right, let's see if I can get up the ladder without alerting the special man. Doubt it. Oh yeah, I'll be fine. His butt is to you. His it's butt like, is at me. But 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 but. Yeah, that's right. <clears throat> All right, so it says it won't with the security level so high, but how do I do anything about the security level? Kill everyone. I think that's what I need to do, but I thought I got everybody. Looks like the door won't open with the so, security level so high. Is there another guy floating around somewhere that I missed? Maybe. Possibly. Possibly brew. Impossibly brew. Brah. Hot do doggeroo. <laughs> God damn it. It's hot dog doggadoo. It is this what the LP is going to devolve into? Okay, I don't Bro. see anybody up top. However, there is a door over there I can go to. Is that the way I need to go? Oh, I can't even get over there. What the fuck? Okay, it's time for a codec call. Like Tell me what's happening. That if you climbed on top, you get a real clear view. Of what? Yeah. Uh, of what and where? <laughs> For reals, girl. Uh, and I just jumped down to my death. See, I'm dead. 
Yeah. Snake's got kind of a goofy running animation in this one. Mm. Yeah, he does, actually. You're what right. am I supposed... Oh, I'm just supposed to use the elevator. Don't let anyone detect you. fucking bullshit. God damn it. <laughs> I guess that's why they all started in front of the elevator. That's like a perfect... That, like, that little start area, if you knew what you were doing, that's like a perfect way to... To just take everybody out, just drop a grenade down there. Oh my god! Like I wish I had stun grenades. Just stun everybody, jump down there, and Fulton my ass off. That would be funny. So yeah, this is the indoor base, and I think it's really a cool indoor base. Oh, and I missed the man. And that time I got the man. Get the man. Miss the man. Touch the man. Love the man. The gun is good. The penis is. Oh, that's a fucking... Oh, that's a bad call. That's, dude. I got it. Yeah, I'm dead. I made sleep. I have handled the situation. You can all go back... Oh. I forgot they run around here. You can all go back to your homes. Hey, come here. Hey. Hey, asshole. Hey, asshole. Hey, asshole. What was that noise? Oh. So, the reason they're not seeing me when I run up on them is because this sneaking suit that I have, I talked about it being OP in every single game ever in the previous yes. uh, LP of uh, yes. Metal Gear Solid 3. It eliminates footstep noise. So I can run around. Oh, is that why? Yeah, I can run around with complete impunity. Ah! 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 Your face. Man. Your face He's is gone. Now. Yes, he is. Is there a confidential document over there? No, but you can put stuff down there later. Hey, look, there's a, there's a prisoner of war. I mean, this isn't... Of war. Whoa! Whoa, there's men! Whoa, there's men! Whoa, that? my god, there is men! Fuck it! Get the fuck out of there! Fucking leap! 1337, bitches! 1337, seriously? Yeah! <laughs> Fatality, or whatever the fuck his name was. Pentium uh, three. I know you can get, uh, I know you can get a shotgun schematic in here. I'm probably wrong and talking out my ass. Really? Yeah. I can't believe there's schematics for shotguns. There is, cause you get you. I have the the one shotgun, the uh, the twin barrel, but uh, you also get the M37 at one point in here. Ooh. Yeah. It's pretty. It's pretty standard. Oh. Oh. There we go. The other man was hiding and has a box. Not a box, but a, uh, you know. Shit, shit. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No. There we go. No, he's graping me. You're graping yourself. Uh, I think they saw. Okay, time to switch to my other silence weapon. Oh, it was that guy. He was chasing after me. But that's okay, because I'm so far beyond any of their reach. So far. I should just launch a grenade at him and run away. <laughs> a little elbow grease will get the shutters open. Mash! Squat, squat, squats. And then run. Yeah, you like now that? Trapped. Now he's trapped. Snake's great at... at, at Gym infiltrating the space. snorting HGH off his off his his gym buddy's pert ass and squat thrusting in each other's faces. Squat, squat, squat. Initiate. You ready for more stupid cutscenes? What's the situation? Sure. We're Actually, no, the cutscenes aren't bad. Are you ready for more stupid uh, quick Don't time trot. events? Oh, quick time events, sure. Yeah. Because I'm not the one doing them. Oh, cold man. Yeah, but you're the one having to watch me fail them repeatedly. Uh, I should just change the name of all 700 of my videos to to fail throughs. So did you mine. see? Did you see that Sony tried to trademark the term "Let's Play"? No, I did not. They did. They tried to trademark the term "Let's Play." It was thrown out of court, and I feel like I should change all of my LPs to to fuck Sony. Fuck Sony, Metal Gear Solid 3, Part 5. Just chilling. Oh my god. Fuck Sony, Halo 4. 
make it name. Yeah, because we know you won't get Halo 5. I have Halo 5. Oh. I have Halo 5. Why don't you get Halo 5 then? I have it. I mean, play Halo 5. For an LP? Yes. Because the story and everything is kind of really weak. Yeah, it is very weak. It's all actually really, really weak. Mm -hmm. So now he's talking to the boss. Never been on a mission. I've never been on a mission there. So this is this is where where it's like, well, it's not, you know, is it the boss? Is it not the boss? And he's just so fucking infatuated that he doesn't care to think that it's just a robot with her voice. Which I think is one of the big weird plot things in this game is that he's so he's so infatuated with the boss that he's ready to believe, you know, anything, pretty much. He's ready for some revelation where he finds out. Yep, there we go. Don't do it. Drop your weapon, big boss. Oh no, there's men. Mammals All kinds. Oh shit. The sure sign that you are nearby. So basically, this thing starts going on the fritz every time it sees Big Boss. Boss, boss, boss. Boss, boss. Boss, boss, boss. Oh, the coyote on the back of his head. Oh, that's the coyote. Oh, he punched him in the face. He got old man punched. So here's where you get some... Here's where you actually first get to talk to... See, he planned Operation Snake Eater. That's you son of a bitch. Yeah. Shut the suit like you be back at Langley. Langley? Fuck me. Fuck Coldman. He's a weirdo. I'll give him that. I like Skullface a lot better. Yeah, Skullface is a better villain. Well, <laughs> he's such a cartoon villain. Yeah, he is. That's why he's better. It's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. I can't wait for the next couple games where you get introduced to the rise and skull of Skullaroo Doggaroo. God damn it. God damn it. Uh, no, it's okay because it's funny. Like the story in, in Phantom Pain is a little eh. Until you get to the end and realize why it's a little eh. But the story in Phantom Pain is a little eh. And then. And then, when the commander of a Russian then you you stop playing it, and you walk away from it for a while, and you go, but that gameplay is some of the best gameplay in gaming. Just, yeah. just period. It is so fantastic. It is amazing. I cannot, I cannot wait. I cannot wait to get to there. And we've only got this, this, this uh, thing right here to get through. We've only got and this so to get through. And I don't want people watching the LP to think that this is not a good game. This is a great game, especially for what it was, especially as a PSP title. Yeah, because you got to remember, this was a handheld game. Just because you're playing on an Xbox doesn't mean you wish for an Xbox. And I feel like, I feel like that's like, that's a cop-out, like saying it's great for a handheld. It's a great, it's a great game. cop-out. I feel like it's kind of a cop out. You're a cop out. Butterflies. Everywhere. Mm. Are those the places they're gonna put? Fucking. Pretty much. So this is interesting. Basically, they're saying that the. Uh, Still don't get it. That. The, age of heroes the America place is in range of the thing. And this is the first time where you kind of get that. That this isn't just a weapon against Russia. This is a weapon against fucking everybody. Surely no one understands that better than you. Except perhaps your partner. So Kaz is a really interesting character in this. And you get a little more characterization of him towards the end. Because he's totally, he's only a support character. But he's so important as a support character, um, and his, his 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 how he's built up in this game really informs the way a lot of the rest of the series goes, um, especially Phantom Pain, uh, because he loves Militaire Sans Frontier. He loves it. He loves his army without a nation. He loves everything about it. So. 
Yeah, I don't want to. God damn it, I don't want to say anymore because it's gonna get into spoilery territory. Don't do that. I feel like I'm showing everybody the first like season of Game of Thrones, and being like, just wait till the next season. It. Oh, I gotta press the button. I press the button. Oh, right trigger. Oh yeah. Oh, I gotta. Nope, no. I fucked it up. Eventually, eventually you fuck it up, or eventually it just happens where you get to the the point, anyways. Because you're supposed to get captured. Oh. So it just gets harder and harder until it's just, fuck it. You f you're fucked. Uh, so, uh, something like that. That's dumb. Clear time kills, enemies left near death. Cutscene interaction bonus, zero of ten. Fuck you. And so... I got bros. And I got prisoner bros. And I got words. I'll give them something to shoot at. So at, 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 at some point in every game, Snake gets captured? Not every... Uh, uh, I'm not doing the turtle thing, I'm thinking. Oh, okay. Y yeah. Yeah, at some point in every game, really? he gets captured. God damn it, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't care about their parameters going up. I don't care about them being hostile. Beat the shit out of them. So they aren't hostile. Let's jam all the these men in the hole. The beatings will continue until morale improves. I'll improve your morale. Yeah, right up the tailpipe. With the yay, I can do the rank three uh, hush puppy. So what's it do now? It's got a much better uh, silencer on it. Oh. All right, let's see. These are the guys. It's not much. It's fine. It's it's good. Also, you carry more ammo with it. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's better. It's probably more accurate. Goldfinch! Let's <clears throat> discharge Woodchuckaroo. You're fired. Oh my god. Yeah, no more woodchucking for you. I'm gonna need to, like, do some soul searching to stop myself from doing that before the next fucking LP. <laughs> oh man. Building supply marker, building the magazine, items, no other items to build at the moment. And let's continue on. I'm gonna select this mission so hard, girl. Why, do you like it? No, I'm just saying it. Torture chamber, escape. Oh, snake only. Maybe I was wrong about that mission thing. Yeah, but I feel like, were. oh, clearing escape. Um, Evade the enemy and escape. MSF soldiers only. Eliminating oh. kidnappers. There's a mission in one of these goddamn games. God damn it. I feel like I'm fucking everything up. This is your fault, Tone Tone. Yeah, right. I'm yeah. the one playing. Also, notice he's, he's wearing an ascot, so. Yeah. His, butt, his ass is about to get ascot. This mission is actually really, really, really tough. Really? Yes. Very, very tough. I don't believe you. It's really hard. Okay, enough fucking around. No! <laughs> We've done enough. This is not the LP of the turtle sex. It could be. If you're loyal to the end, the end is dead, so you don't have... No, I'm just kidding. So do I have to... Do I have to do this fucking cutscene again? Yep. This whole game is Snake cutting all ties and getting pissed off about how he was used. Yeah. And it's gonna happen. Too. It's gonna happen. Which is interesting, because every single one of these games, like 3, this game, um, uh, and V, it's all about Snake becoming a bad guy. And that's, I mean, oh no, she's going to shock my balls. Where was I going with that? Go ahead. Yeah, Snake becoming a bad guy. Yeah, and I, that's kind of spoilery, but... All these games are about Snake becoming a bad guy. So at the end of it, you get this logical point where it's like, okay, well, he's a bad guy now. It's like, now he's pissed off. Now he's going to do all this other shit that happens later in the series. But wouldn't you become a bad guy, too, if you figured out that you were being used for a war? Or not a war, uh... The fuck is it? Stuff. Yeah, stuff. Kind of. But... 
My whole, uh, my whole thing is, you always get to this defining moment at the end where he's like, "Fuck everybody! I'm gonna murder everybody!" And then the game starts again. It's like, "Oh, we're doing the same thing. Nothing's really happened. We're just kind of good guys." So this is uh, one of the torture scenes, one of the first torture scenes since two, I think, where you have to jam on the button to get your health back. She's gonna shock. She's gonna shock. Shock my balls. I gotta hit. Why? Why? Yeah. Oh, my arms starting to cramp. Okay. What is that? What? I killed her. I know that. I like how snakes just like taunting her. Snakes are like, ah, oh, you're a stupid fart butt. Why would a hero? You're cut. So oh, she doesn't know. Nobody knows but Snake and Eva what the boss really did. And, you know, the people who planned the mission. So that means that Coldman isn't being on the level with this chick either. Yeah, because he knew. Yep. Oh, shit. And what about that scar? What about that scar? Yeah. What scar? He has an S-shaped scar on his chest. Um... That he basically put on himself uh, to to look like the boss. Because remember, the boss had that cesarean scar that went from her neck, like to her, you know, yeah, girly girl part. Yeah. So Snake put a scar on his chest in the same way, which I don't think is reflected in uh, the Phantom Pain, but I could be wrong. I could be wrong. What a hell of a cesarean scar, though. Yeah, that's like. You're a fucked up doctor. It's like getting an autopsy. It's like your it's like your doctor was Leatherface. <laughs> Let me get that baby out of you. I mean, <laughs> or they were doing it in like some makeshift hospital on a truck and they were escaping. Well, he was born on D-Day in Normandy, or she did have the kid on D-Day in Normandy. The kid being Ocelot, I think I talked about that in uh, the thing, because they never really go into that. I never really go into that, but I know I'm good authority. Kojima told me he came to my house and he was like, "Oh yeah, she, she fucking she shat him out on a beach." My dad works at Konami, and he told me. <laughs> my dad works at Konami, and he told me that Snake's gonna win in the next one. He also told me that they have Kojima's balls in a jar. Bullshit. Fucking. Do you like that picture I sent you? Yeah, that picture's great. Fucking Konami. <laughs> They're fucked. I Whatever. feel like there's sexual tension in this scene. Are you protecting? There's not, but I feel like there is, but it, I'm not. You want there to be sexual tension. Hey, sexual tension is the best tension. Like, imagine if I'm being hunted down by enemies in the base, and we all just take out our cocks and start just... Sword fighting. Oh! 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 I was being a jackass and not paying attention! Ah! Vagina, vagina, vagina! So, this is just... This is how coffee works, everybody, for those of you who don't know. So, this is, this is, the, this is the origins of Starbucks. She's the weird harpy pagan god spreading her leg... Fins. Whatever. Yeah, shut up. Shut shut your mouth. So if you don't jam on why he dies, right? Yeah. Oh, he passed out. Quick, now oh. shock him again. Get in there. She's not very good at torture. No. Nope. No, not at all. No. And Snake's probably like, eh, whatever, a little pain, nothing too bad. Pretty much. Snake is like, do you remember what happened to me in the last game? Try to remember the basics of CQC. I got shock punched to fucking death. And lost an eye. Don't be getting any ideas. Don't be getting any ideas. Hey, hey, put your dick right there in my hand. I'm not looking, so it's not gay. Ugh. I forget how to get out of here, to be uh, perfectly honest. Wait, did I just like lay down? Room. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I can lay down here. I think this is one of the only places where I can lay down. I have, I have my it? stun rod? Why would they leave this with me? Kojima. If I remember, I can Kojima look in here. Sucks. Oh, look at that, look at that. What'd you pull out? Jigsaw. 
Is that what's in the scar? He had a jigsaw hiding in his scar. Oof. How fucking crazy is that? That is so badass. I gotta do it. I gotta do it when nobody's here. Oh no! Oh no! Oh god, oh jeez, oh god, oh jeez. Oh Jesus God, oh ham sandwich. Oh. What are you doing? Oh shit, he saw me, I'm fucked. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun dun. Snake? What happened? Answer, Answer me, me, snake snake. Snake snake! Snake snake! Fuck it! Fuck it! Let's try this again. Okay. Let's go through all the go through all the uh, the cutscene again, do all the torture again. Are you ready for this? No, I'm Are you re no, I'm kidding. <laughs> Excuse me. So this is the first one where they're literally where there isn't like some clever trick to getting the shit done. It's literally just you have a jigsaw in, in your fucking thing. Your fucking scar. Yeah. You think that's why he made that scar in the first place? Probably not. Wonder if I can hide uh, things in my scar. Ah fuck, you saw no, you can't hide things in your scar. It's a fucking anime, you idiot. I can try! Asshole! Hide a Naruto manga in your scar. No. Okay, we're gonna try it. We're gonna take another stab at this on the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you next time. Bye bye!